Hey guys, um, I'm probably going to delete this video in like an hour, but it really had to be made because, you know, I just can't keep getting away with it. Um, I, I've been really, really hateful in the last few videos that I've made um, with the jokes that I've been making in the beginning about the LGBT, L, LGBTQ plus community. Um, and I already, I know, I, guys, I know, I already, I already know what you guys are going to be talking about, talking about, oh, that wasn't hate, that was a joke, but no, guys, sometimes jokes are hate, and when you really, like, think about it, maybe too much, um, fit. pretty much every joke can, can be hateful, and my jokes are pretty hateful. Um, so if, here's the part where if you, if you have like pets or, or kids or something, you probably want to cover their ears or, uh, tell them to get out of the room because I'm, I'm going to tell you guys the kind of hateful stuff that I've been saying over the last few, uh, weeks just so you can really just kind of understand like how bad of a person that I am so that when I come clean and tell you that that I'm sorry and stuff, then you can, like, then you'll know, like, how good of a person I am. <laughs> um, so, what I said, I think the first time I made the joke was I said that LGBT stands for let's get this bread. Sorry, I was trying not to cry. Um, like, people might look at that and be like, "What's what's the big deal? That says that doesn't sound hateful." But guys, bread. That's like, if you could imagine ISIS coming to your house and kidnapping your uh, whole family and um, burning your house down and then cutting off your head that's like that's like what a, a LGBT goes through when you say that their acronym stands for something that it doesn't even stand for like even if it's not even if you're not saying it stands for anything like hateful or even really not having anything to do with L with actual LGBT stuff at all it's hate just because it's a joke, but it's a joke that has to do with them. So that means you're making fun of them, which means it's hate. Like, duh. So, yeah. ISIS. And, um, I can't even believe, I can't even believe it gets worse. I'm just, like, so ashamed. Uh, then later I said that, that that LGBT stand, doesn't stand for let's get this bread, it stands for let's get this brass. And, um, guys, brass, I just, I, it, it, like, really, like, scares me and, like, hurts me that I can go to such a dark place that I literally think that it's like a joke to say LGBT stands for let's get this brass when that's not a joke that's like that's like the definition of hate that's like imagine if you were like fighting in Vietnam and um like you stepped on a landmine and your legs blew off and like a little Vietnam guy ran up and didn't even give you your legs back. He took them and threw them in a blender so that you wouldn't even be able to put them back on. Like, that's... Mentally, that's what an LGBT goes through when you tell him that it's... Let's get this brass. That's like... I can't even believe that I would, like, put anybody through that. But remember, this is my apology video, so... This means that I'm, like... Honestly, a really good person now. Um, and, uh, oh, 
jeez, this is the worst one. I didn't even want to say this. I'm sorry, guys. Um, the last one that I said just today, or yesterday, um, I said that LGBTQ plus stands for let's make a spear out of a wrench today. It's ma'am. And just that level of hate, it's like, it's like, it, if you've ever heard of Hiroshima, <laughs> <laughs> if you've ever heard of Hiroshima, it's like the hate equivalent of Hiroshima times 10 getting dropped directly onto a trans baby's head. So yeah, it's not some small deal. That's what is mentally, traumatically, dramatically, intrinsically, uh, emotion? going on in an LGBT's head, if you say that their acronym is something that it isn't, that it's not even, that's not even what it is. So that means, that means it's hate. So guys, if you're out there and you're one of the, what, tens of thousands of people who have been doing that meme that's like, where you just take LGBT and you say it stands for something else, you know, Luigi got big titties, uh, or you say the B in, in, uh, bionic, B in LGBT stands for bionicle, or the let's get this bread one, I didn't even make that up, that was already a meme. If you're one of those guys, and you think that's okay, check yourself, mister, because that is, honestly... It's like, you're, you're just a few steps away from an actual genocide. So, thanks for listening, guys. Uh, uh, namaste. Wassalamu alaikum. Shabbat shalom. Uh, and uh, Feliz Navidad. And good night. See you guys later. Glad, uh, glad I'm a good person now.